up y'all it is the start of another vlog and guess what y'all we are a week out from august can you believe it so you'll probably be seeing this vlog in august so happy august to everyone y'all i'm ashley if you are new to this channel and the person pulling up a seat beside me or wherever she's pulling it uh not beside me that's miss melanie the guy in the back is Mr. Daryl Crawford, and then what's, we. <laughs> what's happening? <laughs> and then we have little Aiden Crawford over there on the sofa eating his milk. Today is an exciting day. Why do you ask? I'll tell you. Because Miss Mel, right here, is going to the dentist for the first time today. <laughs> take her to the dentist in the past when she was one and that was just a disaster so then I found this pediatric dentist and they were like oh she doesn't need to come until um, she's three that's when we actually clean their teeth so she's already eaten her food we got about an hour and a half before we're gonna leave out of the house I'm about to make me some oatmeal and then uh, I'll let you guys know what I was in the process of doing and show y'all some stuff, but let's go and make this oatmeal. some um iced coffee in my what is this it's it's a mom daily affirmations cup i got this from a girl called cj's creations on uh instagram it's a really lovely cup i love it it has just enough in it well i'll be having to make two cups sometimes yeah. but it's really cute and this is what the top of it looks like so if you want to support another mom and another small business check out cj's creations on instagram and pick you up a mom daily affirmations cup all right so mel for my next trick i'm gonna make mommy's cup disappear okay disappear? yeah i'm gonna make it disappear okay <laughs> with your magic wand. <laughs> so, Mommy, can you please uh, pick up the cup, please, and show it to the good people, the Crawford cuties. All right. <laughs> Abra, I can't see myself. Hold up, Abra, daddy. Cadabra. Mommy. And there you have it, folks. Daddy, daddy. We, dis we made the cup disappear. All right, cool. So, yeah. man, don't get my belly. He's so tall, y'all, but. Yeah, don't get my belly. That was his magic trick for y'all. <laughs> My belly all in the camera. Anyways, so I was sitting here recording for um my planners and I might answer the video that I did, but here's just a picture that I took today of it. And another one. And I'm gonna start actually planning in this planner in August. August is gonna be a big month for us. We have a lot of, uh-uh. Uh we have a lot of, uh, well, Babe has a lot of travel coming up. My birthday is in August. Aiden's surgery is in August. There's a lot going on in the month of August. So we're going to whip out this bad boy right here because it can go on your purse or whatever. So if you want to get you one to go in your purse, <laughs> go to ForTheCreator.com and go to the Planet Right page, y'all. It's in the description box. It's on the bottom of the screen right here. Y'all go pick up your planner. There's a limited quantity of these. So once the um, amount that I have are gone, then uh, it'll just be like pre-order. So you order and then uh, I will have to place the order to get you these. Now, I don't make these particular covers right, but the inside is my original 
work, y'all. It's just the cover on this particular size planner, the A5 planner that um, I have outsourced and made, so that's why they have to be uh, pre-ordered. But if you wanna get the eight and a half by 11 version and start planning your life, because these planners are undated, y'all could definitely go check out forthecreator.com to get yours. So I'm just about to sit here and edit um, some reels, because I'm supposed to be dropping this planner collab because uh, I collaborated with a young lady named Allie Alon. She's on Instagram as well. But I'm supposed to be dropping this planner collab today. So I need to go ahead and edit that reel and all that stuff so I can um, put that out. And yeah, but you know what? Help your girl out. Spread the word. You know what I'm saying? Even if, you know, you don't use planners, but you know someone who does, like... Stop going to these big corporations, support your girl, small business owner, and get the planner today. But yeah, we're gonna edit some reels and then we're gonna hop in the car at about 2.10, 2.15, so we can go over to the dentist. This is gonna be hilarious, but I am curious to see how your girl is going to do in that chair. first visit to the dentist she did all right in my opinion it wasn't you know that's why I couldn't work and nothing to deal with no children because they have the patience of literal saints me I'm not doing all that open your mouth let's brush your teeth and get it on over with sweetheart but she did all right she was a little scared her next appointment is in six months in February and um Hopefully at that appointment, she'll be a lot more comfortable and they can use the actual uh, teeth cleaner as opposed to just brushing her teeth. Cause I could have brushed her teeth at home. But yeah, the doctor did look at her teeth and he said that we're doing a good job with brushing them because she does not have any cavities. So we're gonna try to stick with that. That's gonna be that one that. Now we are headed over to, um, I think I want to get me a slushy at the store, but we'll see. But let me call y'all back, because they back here, child, and I don't know if Mel's going to get rowdy, rowdy, about it, about it. Where my Master P fans at? But we're back in the house, y'all, and I forgot to tell y'all something. So while I'm making my lunch, I'm about to have a, um, a chicken Caesar salad. And I'm eating these little life checks mix that I done dropped on the floor. But I forgot to tell y'all something. So let me go to the corn and get it real quick. Y'all had to take me a little breather for a second. Cause folks, it's getting on my nerves. Y'all like that? My car just opened by itself, watch this. <laughs> But yeah, I'm gonna grab what I came out here to get. Well, I'll just um, show y'all out here. So, guess what? I am becoming a dance mom. Told y'all, August is a really, really uh, busy, big month for us. And Mel, let me hold it up one more time just in case I need a thumbnail. Mel, y'all, is starting ballet on August the 
9th, I want to say, because I think that's going to be um, that Wednesday. So, in that bag, hold on. In that bag, I've already gotten her dance shoes and we got her a bag for her outfit to go in. And the um, lady that, oh, that's dark. The lady that owns the dance studio, she is providing the outfits for the dancers. So that's gonna be cool. And this, let me see. I signed her up for August through December. And if she likes it, we'll sign her up for January through June. She is going to do the June recital next year in 2024. But um, we're just going to see how she does to see if she, you know, needs to continue from January to June. But I am very, very excited for her. And I'm excited for myself because this is a way for me to meet other moms. Now, I won't be able to go to all of the, um, dance classes because i um do boot camp on mondays and wednesdays because i'm trying to get my fitness on but i will go to the first one my sister will finish out the month of august because it's going to take the village for us to get through the month of august literally and um then we'll go from there september through december but y'all know i'm gonna take y'all along the journey with us with mel um being in dance class but i asked her you know did she want to try gymnastics again or um you know what she wanted to do and she said dance so i'm like uh oh, you know what kind of dance because uh the school offers hip-hop ballet um tap and she chose ballet so that'll be fun but let me see what's literally cooking with the chicken over here in the air fryer, of course. And then I'll cut that all up, put it on my salad. Probably not going to eat with y'all. Probably just might come back tomorrow when we go to boot camp. Because I don't have anything else going on the rest of the day. I might go um, on a tour of a house with my sister. Because we are selling the house that we purchased together. 10 years ago and um she is going to purchase another home but i am helping with the down payment so i do kind of have a stake in it so you know but we'll see if i go and look at it today if not i'll see y'all tomorrow good morning you guys was well, actually about to be afternoon it's the next day tuesday july 26th yeah I just literally came on camera to say hello for this morning. I'm not about to do anything except for eat some oatmeal, then get some editing done. Sorry about the loud noise in the back. Mel loves this show called Danny Go on YouTube. So it's very, uh, it gets your kids up moving and all that good stuff. Today is boot camp day. So I'll take y'all to boot camp with me but i'm literally about to go through my day oh we do have some cleaning to do so um if i want to come back on camera to clean i might do that but anyways we're literally just gonna roll on through with the day but i will definitely see y'all at boot camp because that's my favorite part of the day i gotta get one of them taller tripods because this ain't gonna work but i decided to Go ahead and clean the house on a random Wednesday afternoon. I was supposed to do it, but me and hubby just discussed, and we're gonna start um, cleaning up every Sunday. I mean, I do not like getting up early on Sundays, but it might just have to be done at this point. And, um, you know, Sundays I go to my parents' house, so just trying to figure that whole thing out, but anyways. Y'all come do a little cleaning with me. I'm currently in the kids' bathroom right now. I'm gonna have to start saying the kids because it was just Mel's bathroom, but now it's gonna be her and Aiden's bathroom. But we're about to start with the tub, toilet, double sinks, and go from there. And then my next thing to clean is Mel's bedroom. Babe said he would clean Aiden's room, which is so weird because that used to be the guest room 
and the office and our room. And we have some laundry to get done and all that stuff. Then there's downstairs to do. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started. I'm not gonna um, film me doing everything, but y'all could just clean with me on this little part, okay? see we're in the car so I was all excited because I thought boot camp was about to get canceled which it did get canceled but then my mom calls me telling me that two tires on my car the air in them is low and one of them is really really low and might need to be patched what it got to do with me we have made it over to my parents house and I'm looking at the tires and I don't see <laughs> cause for concern here. What do you think, babe? So this is my old car, guys. I'm just checking. I'm just testing. And this is my new one. And there's my mom. Okay, so there actually was an issue guys. It was the back right tire As you can see here Mel was about to help my dad patch it, but she ran off mm -hmm. <laughs> Hey, get here. I won't put him on camera y'all because he'll never say hey to y'all <laughs> Hold it <laughs> Oh, it's heavy, huh? Is heavy? Mm -hmm. Oh, girl, please. <laughs> Use a typical female. <laughs> Use a female. So this is how you patch a tire, guys. Excuse me, Bill. Get the money down! Oh! 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 So basically, you have the stick that thing uh, all the way in there and be able to pull it back out to catch it. Oh! I'm uh, might have to try, but I'll come back and let you guys know what happened. Back at the house, I just wrapped up a 25-minute workout. I did the hip hop with feel, whatever it is. It's on YouTube, y'all can um, Google it. And now I am literally about to clean up their playroom, wash the dishes. I know it seems like I've been cleaning all day, but that whole tire fiasco kind of just threw the timing of everything off. Because two, I wanna get some editing done today. I wanna start where whenever I'm recording footage, I am going back and editing that footage that day so that when I'm done, I can, you know, upload everything going by my business. But we did get something from Amazon. So let's see if I can, sometimes it's so hard to tear them little things off. But oh, it's here. So I got me another SD card because the one that I'm currently filming on only has one hour and 45 minutes left. I had saw something where people like delete their raw footage once they've made the videos and uploaded them, but I just can't let go of the footage because my kids are in it and it's moments in the footage that don't even make it to the video because I'm like, oh, nobody wants to see that or whatever the reason. So yeah, I cannot delete my raw footage, but this time, I got 512, uh, what is this, gigabytes. This ran me what, like, it was $69, but with tax and everything, it was $75. One that I saw was 80 something dollars, which I thought was weird. I normally get the one terabyte cards, but those have been going for 
200 but they do last you a full year these last about six months so that works and i did see that timu has sd cards if you have ordered an sd card off of timu and successfully used it please let me know because on the internet they have them looking like the sandisk brand which is this but i was like mm, timu i'm not so sure about that but yeah i'm gonna go ahead and clean up their playroom it's no point of me showing you guys my dinner because it's just gonna be a salad um and then this time we are gonna come back either tomorrow or friday when i go and run some errands because friday something should be in that p.o box if not i'm gonna be a little upset but speaking of the p.o box y'all know from the previous footage i was going to go pick up a sample planner that i had ordered one of the um hardcover ones but speaking of planners y'all that resin planner that i showed y'all some videos back it's doing very well on instagram it's just i need to make some sales y'all so if anybody out there is good with marketing and selling things let me know because i'm not so good at that part but i'm gonna get there god got me but let me go i'm gonna holler at y'all either on thursday more than likely on friday oh because friday too at five i know i keep talking about friday too at 5 30 i have a dinner to go to to meet a mom that i met in a group on facebook she has a son around my daughter's age so uh we were originally going to have a play date with the kids but since i was going to bring my husband her husband thought it was best that she and I meet first, see if we want to be friends or whatever the case may be, then bring the kids and then bring the husbands into it. But for real, for real this time, y'all, I will see y'all on Thursday, more than likely Friday. <laughs> Another day, another dollar, make your girl wanna holla. Y'all, it's day three of the vlog and Mel and I are out running some quick errands. So I'm gonna go back to the post office today. It's what, currently 12 p.m. Thursday, July 27, I think. Y'all, when I go back to work, I'ma know what the date is, trust me then. I'm gonna know what the date is. But yeah, Mel and I are going back to the P.O. box to see if my package that I'm waiting for is in there. Now, it's been two days, so it should be in there, y'all. Um, I tried to set up the, um, the alerts on the P.O. box, but it was saying that I had the wrong information. So I need to actually um, go up to the front and speak to a clerk and get some help on um, linking the, I think it's called informed delivery to my address, but whatever, that's another thing. I'll show y'all what it is on the phone. But yeah, I'm so excited. After the PO box, we have to go to Walgreens because I need to buy me one of them blood pressure cuffs that goes um, around your arms and that you pump instead of the little um, automatic ones they have because your girl's blood pressure, so, after my six week checkup so my six week checkup i was fine after having anan and then i went to the doctor probably a month or two later and all of a sudden i have elevated blood pressure out of nowhere now i will be turning 35 in what two weeks at this point and i know that when my mom dad and sister hit 35 that's when all he double hockey sticks started to break loose um and, but I don't want high blood pressure. I don't want to have to take pills. I don't want to have to do any of that. So I am trying to get my health in order and trying to get to the point where I will not have to take pills or anything of that nature. 
so I want to be able to keep a good watch on my blood pressure and keep working out and doing the things that I'm supposed to do to get my numbers back in order so I'm gonna see y'all cuz uh, we just grabbed us some Duncan this time I did not get my normal order I actually reduced what I normally get so that's going to reduce some of the calories but um yeah we're gonna eat this head on over to the p.o box and pray y'all pray 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 that what i'm looking for is in that daggone box so that was a dud again guys i really need someone to help me to link this p.o box to my account because that's the second time we done wasted time and gas coming over here even though it gets mail out of the house she gets to see all the beautiful airplanes over here near the airport but <sighs> oh, I should have recorded for y'all for those who have never seen the Porsche plant it's here in Atlanta and it's right up here by um, the post office that I go to if I can get a good shot of it I'll record it for you guys but I'm really really sad right now y'all I was looking forward to having my other sample in my hands today. Mel, you missed that big old one right there. Huh? You missed that big plane. I miss you. Yeah, I'll try to catch you another one. But y'all, let me ride her around the back side of this airport so she can uh, try to see these planes. I'm gonna try to catch what I can on camera for y'all. Cause you know, we stay very close to Hartsville Jackson, so. It is a treat. Even if you've flown on planes a billion times, you know, uh, oh, darn. All these potholes. Being able to see the plane, especially like when it's landing and everything and seeing it so low and how massive they are, it's really a really cool experience, in my opinion. It'll never get old to me. But let's ride, y'all. Uh, the box is here. This is it. This is it. This is it. So your gua. See, see, see. Your gua is about to get ready to do an unboxing for y'all. Here's Mel. <laughs> so let's do this unboxing. Oh my god. That's it. Mom, what's that, Pen? Friday, y'all. Today is, I think, day four of the vlog. I want to say, but guess what? I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I'm Ashley Crawford. Made my first sale. So I woke up this morning. I was on my Facebook. And then I seen one of my girls. Um, well, she was in this Facebook group that I was in for YouTube. But then the group got this Spanish girl, honey. We're Destiny's child of, of Facebook. <laughs> and, you know, everyone's still, still friends. Still kind of keep in touch, all that good stuff. And I looked this morning. She had reposted my video. And then said she purchased a planner and couldn't wait to have it in hand. So then I checked my email and it's like, new order. And I'm like, oh my God, thank you so much. So I'm excited about that. So y'all friend is laying on the bed. Hold on. Say good morning, Aiden. <laughs> That's y'all friend number two. And friend number one, hold on. 
I know it's close. It's in her bathroom. What's wrong? What's wrong, child friend? But she's supposed to be in here brushing her teeth. I don't know what she's freaking out about. Did you brush your teeth? No. Let me brush this girl's teeth. I am back. Oh, my eyebrows look a mess because when you get a tan and you're still using the same concealer that you were using when you didn't have a tan, it looks horrible. Somebody could put on some moisturizer to do that. But y'all, I am in my home office because, as I told y'all, I made my first sale today and now I am about to do, um, a pack and order with me video i am so excited y'all this uh couldn't have come at a better time Ooh. <laughs> because i mean i was kind of getting discouraged i don't know what's going on with my nose but it's aggravating me oh y'all i'm going next week to get my eyebrows arched and all that stuff because we're going out of town next friday and your girl got to look, you know, decent. But I was getting very discouraged because, you know, you see um, on Instagram, all the girls, um, you know, with their planners and making all these sales and all these great things going on with their business. And I know people only show you, um, you know, one side of things, but it still looks nice to see all those orders and stuff so we're having humble beginnings right now which is all good with me and shout out to cindy 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 shout out to you um one of the moms that i met in the melanin moms group on facebook y'all um as i mentioned earlier but shout out to you you guys shout out to you girl i mean this means the world to me. It really and truly does. So, we're about to pack Cindy's order. I was going to print off the shipping here at my house. But I want to do everything at the post office. So I know um, going forward, you know, how much shipping costs. And now I get to update my Excel sheet that I keep for... Um, you know, to let me know anything I've sold, all that good stuff. So, I'm excited. And right now, the planners that I do have, so, as I showed y'all, it's these planners with the resin covers on them. So, it's just a clear resin cover like that. And it's so cool because if you do buy one of these planners, once you've used all the inserts for them, you could just buy more inserts, but you'll still have your covers so that's a great thing or you can turn it into a notebook whatever you want to do but um yeah i don't have a large quantity of those planners and probably won't even make like a major profit off of this first um flip basically but i'm doing this because it's something i truly enjoy doing and it's just a great feeling it's not even about the money um for me I've never been a person, so I'm trying to say this the right way, but I've never been, a, I, I care about money, but I'm not in love with it, all of that. I know what I need money for, and I know what I need to do with it. Um, like how people get, you know, these major blessings to be blessed with large quantities of money and stuff, and then fumble the ball, like, if God puts me in that position, ball will definitely not be fumbled because I already have it in my mind what needs to be done. And my primary focus is taking care of my family and making sure my parents and now my husband's parents are taken care of in their old age. So I'm not trying to be rich. I'm just trying to be I guess you could use the word wealthy and comfortable. That's my primary goal. But y'all, let's pack this order. I'm talking too much. Even though I did say I'm gonna start talking a lot more on the channel. But yeah, if you wanna give me some well wishes or some prayers, 
for my small business, put it down in the comments below. But come on, y'all. Pack this order with me. We are all done packing the order. This is how I pack it. I put my handmade with lots of love on there. And then we seal it with three at the bottom. But this is it. I kind of feel like I should, um, I don't know, pack it a little. Well, not pack it, but like put some tape down here just so it's a little more secure. Luckily, this is traveling within the same state, and I have to print me off uh, one of those maps so I can color in where I made a sale. But luckily, this is traveling within the same state, so now I need to go to the post office and send this off to her today, y'all. I'm still in disbelief. I'm still in disbelief. I had to take um, the order to the post office. My mom is here now about to braid Mel's hair and I just had to pop on because I am so nervous because I'm about to go meet um, a mom that I met in this mom group on Facebook and she was asking me was I introvert or extrovert went through that whole spiel and I was like, I was asking my husband, like, what do I say? Because she was like, she was looking up questions to ask me. And my husband was like, y'all are ridiculous. Just talk to each other. So I'm getting nervous about it, but um, I'm hoping the conversation goes well and that, you know, it doesn't get awkward or anything. But my goodness, I'm very, very nervous. But at least we're going to eat my favorite food, which is Mexican food. Oh my god, I got this pool so tight, but oh, I'm so nervous, y'all. But when I get back, I see I'm gonna have to sweep and do all that stuff again. It's like this house never stays freaking clean because of these kids. But I'm gonna have to wrangle Mel and get her in this chair to get her hair done because she's already back there saying smart stuff. So I'm gonna see y'all when I get in the car and we've got to eat some Mexican together. So, uh, let me turn this down a little bit, y'all. So, that went pretty well, I guess. Um, we'll see, you know, how the future goes. But I'm about to head back home. I ordered my mom some food from the restaurant. And hopefully she enjoys it. But we shall see. We shall see. But let's get on back over okay, to Okay, baby. What's up, y'all? It's another day on the vlog. Let me um, pause this really quickly so that we don't 
get copyright. But got the family in the back. There's Miss Melanie. Uh, Aiden's in the middle. It's not focusing, but that's okay. And then there's it's all good. They know we here though. Hubby's in the back. <laughs> Woo boy, he cut his hair and he uh get real vain, baby, real vain. Wow. But <laughs> we're just out. Uh, as y'all can see, Mel and her hair ain't finished back there, if you can see. But we're out and about. We're about to go get me some Dunkin' because I've started intermittent fasting, y'all. I just decided last night I was gonna do it after watching. Um, uh oh. After watching Gina Janine's vlog, I was like, let me go ahead and just start intermittent fasting again and see how that works out for me because I basically do it anyway. But whatever. So I'm gonna go grab me some Dunkin' because it's 12.02. Oh, wait a minute. What time is it? Yeah, 12.02. And I can um, eat now. And then we're going over to this electronic store in Smyrna yeah. to go ahead and get Mel a uh, because she lost her iPod in the house somewhere. We don't know where the thing is, but it was getting older anyway. The battery was starting to die. And like now an electronic should last Mel a lot longer because she'll be in school for half of the day. And then she'll only use it a couple hours maybe. And then you go into bed. So we're gonna get her another one because two will be going on a trip on Friday. And I want her to, you know, have something to grab in the car. Oh, well, okay, she just said it. <laughs> Mel is smart, y'all. But, um, yeah, I want her to be able to, you know, have a variety of things to do. I was going to try to find her one of those activity pad things that you have in the car. So, I'm going to do that too on Amazon. But anyways, after that, we have to come back home and Mel has to finish getting her hair done so my mom will come over and finish doing her hair. Oh, I can cut the grass today. Oh, babe said he can cut the grass today. So, oh, that's, that's all the plans we have. I was going to go and get Mel's school supplies, but I'm going to do that during the week. And also during the week, I'm going to go shopping for um, the kids a couple outfits, me a couple outfits, um, all that good stuff. But that'll be in the next long but anyways let me shut my mouth and get on in this doggy one Mom, don't say that. yes ma'am getting mail it's like a um ipad air y'all it was only 99 dollars in the store now the stuff is not brand new or anything and i don't know if that store is like a pawn shop or whatever it is but i'm glad we were able to get that before we go on the trip on next friday and yeah my parents just left here y'all didn't see they came over because my mom finished mel's hair but that was basically a bunch of days in the life with me. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure you hit that like button, y'all. And also hit the subscribe button if you haven't already subscribed to the channel and hit the notification bell. With all that being said, I hope that y'all stay cool, calm, and Crawford. And I'm definitely gonna see y'all in the next video. Bye. Bye. Where you at, Mel? Right there. Right there?